Hi and welcome to Mimi Math. Today we are looking at the patterns of I. So let's write down the four values with the pattern of I. And I is equal to the square root of negative one. So we're going to put I, and I'm not going to put to the first power because we just assume that. So I is equal to negative one. But I squared is equal to negative one squared. Well, when you square a square root, they're opposite operations, so we just get out a negative one. I cubed is equal to I times I squared because you just add the exponents, right? So I is equal to itself and I squared is equal to negative one. So when we multiply those together, we get negative I. And then I to the fourth power is equal to I squared times I squared. Well, I squared is negative one times negative one which is a positive one. So i to the fourth is negative, or is positive one. Now i to the fifth will end up being i. i to the sixth is negative one. i to the seventh is negative i. And i to the eighth is one. And it keeps repeating all the way through the pattern. So we're going to use this pattern of four to find the value of all these exponents of i. And we could take like i to the 17th power here. We could count through the pattern 17 times, but we don't need to. What we need to do is take 17 and divide it by four. You divide it by four because that's how many values there are in the pattern of i. And we divide 17 by four and we get a remainder of one. Now this is really all we care about is this remainder. We say, okay, I'd count through the pattern four times, but my remainder is one, so it's gotta be the first one in the pattern, so the answer to i to the 17th is just i. Okay, so the next one is 